Welcome to the Swift 2 tutorial video. In this video, we're going to show you the basic features and precautions of the Swift 2. The aircraft. The Swift 2 is built onto an extremely durable 3.5mm full carbon fiber frame. An FPV camera is mounted on the nose of the Swift. Real-time video can be viewed using an FPV monitor or goggles. The mushroom antenna transmits video in all directions. Mounted onto the arms are 5-inch 3-blade propeller, 2300 kV motors and motor guards. The motor guards protect the motors from damage due to unpredictable crashes and also serve as landing gear. The micro USB is used for parameter tuning, firmware upgrades and ESC calibration on the computer. The video transmission bud is used to select the best transmission channel and power level. The numbers next to the button indicate the currently selected channel and power level. The strap is used to secure the battery. Place the battery with the power cable facing up and towards the front of the aircraft. Twist the cable into the strap and tighten the strap. This will prevent the cables from being cut or damaged by the spinning propellers. The power cable and the receiver antennas. The rear LEDs indicate flight status during flight. The Swift's radio controller. The Swift pairs with a 2.4G RC transmitter. The two joysticks are configured as follows. The left joystick controls the throttle and yaw. The right joystick controls the forward and reverse movement and the left or right movement. By pushing both sticks up and inwards, the FC parameters can be adjusted and tuned through the FPV monitor or goggles. To avoid undesirable losses, beginners are strongly advised not to change any of the preset parameters. There are four switches on the transmitter, motor arming, rear LEDs on or off, flight modes and on-screen on or off. To avoid misuse and to ensure safety, the aircraft has built-in precautions to ensure a safe launch. If the motor lock unlock switch is in the unlock position or the throttle joystick is not in its lowest position, the aircraft also has safe launch precautions. If the aircraft is tilted at an angle, the motors cannot be armed. The built-in touchscreen can be used to adjust the various parameters of the transmitter. It is not recommended that beginners change the parameters. Next to the screen are two power buttons. To avoid unintentional power on or off, both buttons must be pressed simultaneously for at least two seconds to turn on or off the RC transmitter. If the aircraft is still powered on, the RC transmitter cannot be turned off and will sound an alarm. Please disconnect the aircraft battery before turning off the controller. The two buzzer buttons on the back help you to locate the aircraft. If you lose the aircraft, press either of the buttons and the aircraft will start beeping, leading you to the aircraft's location. Thanks for watching this video. For more information about Swift 2, please check out our other flight tutorials. We hope you enjoy your experience with this wonderful, nimble and versatile aircraft. Please remember, don't blink, because the Swift is fast.